Hello YouTube, this is Keith Kevin Kent. How you doing? How you doing? Man, I hope you're doing well. I really do. It's time again for another knife of the day. This is the series where I go through my collection one knife at a time, one day at a time. My collection is in five Pelican cases, four 1550s and one 1600, and they're jam-packed, maybe two jam-packed inside of them. We're going one knife a day. Yeah, one knife a day, Monday through Friday. This playlist, it's a big playlist, so go check it out. Today, the knife of the day is the Chris Reeve collaboration with Wilson Combat and their division, Wilson Tactical. It's the small Starbenza. Have you heard of it before? You know, I was buying Chris Reeve knives and starting my collection of Chris Reeve knives, and this name popped up, and I'm like, what the heck is that? At first, I just thought it were was uh, knife people having a nickname for Chris Reeve knives, you know, Starbenza. Then I looked it up, and I got a picture of it, and I'm like, huh? And of course, I just went crazy, because it was another Chris Reeve knife I didn't know anything about. So I went to try to buy them. Um, you can only buy these from the WilsonCombat.com. It's part of Wilson Combat and their tactical part. Wilson Combat does guns and some knives and other things like that. And so for several years now, they've been working with Chris Reeve Knives on their special knife. It's exclusive to them, and it's the Starbenza. This is the small Starbenza. They have a Starbenza um, for the Chris Reeve Sabenza 25. They have a Starbenza version of the large and small 21, and they have something that they call Star Tac, which is the Umnumzun treatment. I've seen on their website that they also have the Nkosi large and small. I don't know if it's available yet, but I see that they're going to work on that as well. Of course, the small and large Nkosi is the replacement for the Sabenza 25. This is the small one, and I really like the small Sabenzas just because it's right under that three inch mark with the blade and it just fits great. I'm a I lean more towards small. I have a lot of big knives, but I lean more towards small. So let's talk about it. For the most part, it's almost like all the other Sabenzas you're used to. You know, it has that hollow ground S35 VN steel blade. See that? It has two studs, left and right. Of course, you know how Chris Reeve operates. He does right-handed knives for the most part, and then he does left-handed ones. So this clip does not move right or left like a lot of knife makers. You have to go find a left-handed one. And of course, Wilson Combat, Wilson Tactical has lefties for the Starbenzas as well. They're available. This is a 2.9 inch blade. That's what I meant. Just right under that three inches. One thing I like about the Chris Reeve blades is how they round the spine of the blade. You know, just everything. They take real care in what they do. Has jimping right there where you need it. But let's not fool each other. <laughs> the big thing about a Starbenza is that starburst pattern. I like it because all Starbenzas, it's like you have all the great things of a um, plain Jane Sabenza with just that carving in it that makes it just wonderful. That starburst is the Wilson Tactical logo. Okay, and so all of 
the knives, the star attack, the human zun as well, has that starburst. And you can feel it. It gives you a little bit of traction, but it's carved in there good. And that's what makes it a starbenza. That and they have a special bead that has Wilson combat on it. Everything else is the same, you know, see-through construction, has the lanyard, but it does have that special bead. When you look on the work side, I call it, with the lock, the one thing is this is the only knife that I know of, the only one I have and that I know of from Chris Reeve where they actually put the markings on the lock bar. Usually Chris Reeve doesn't do that. He can have inlays, he can have all kinds of things, but he leaves that lock bar plain. In this case, that has the star benza starburst pattern as well. And on the clip, yeah, it has the Western the it has the Wilson Tactical logo on it right there. Of course it has a Chris Reeve integral frame lock. And it is made by Chris Reeve. Everything else is just perfect. They're smooth. They're wonderful. They really are. And I like the added oomph. You don't see a lot of Star Benzas around a lot. You know, you see the fancy smancy Chris Reeve knives. But if you go to Wilson Combat, they're selling them. They have the exclusivity on it. There you have it. It's the small Sabenza 21 from Wilson Combat and Wilson Tactical. It's the small Starbenza 21. This is one of my brand new <laughs> Delicas. I, I, I did, that was the knife of the day yesterday and boy has it gotten reaction on Instagram and on YouTube because of the teal scales but i wanted to give you a feel for the standards from spydeco with the small as you can see the small starbenza 21 and here's the para 3 so kind of gives you that great edc feel small enough to carry with no problem big enough to take care of anything you need to take care of with a everyday carry knife there you have it that's the knife of the day hope you're doing great hey 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 take a couple of minutes away uh from social media man i have so much trouble doing that i really do <laughs> turn off everything and just spend some time for yourself man i didn't do that until what 10 years ago i'm 58 gonna be 59 this summer <sighs> who knows what would have happened if I did it at your age, 20s, 30s, 40s, man, better, would have been a better father, definitely better husband, just a better friend all around. So take some time with you. Sometimes it's not a pretty thing. It doesn't have to be all day. Take a half hour or an hour. This isn't some West Coast hippie stuff. <laughs> <laughs> this is just about you. It's okay to be selfish every now and then. Us men don't do that often. Do it. That's it. You have a perfect day. Keep those pockets full. Goodbye.